With Marvel's The Falcon and the Winter Soldier just around the corner with its fall 2020 release, I thought that I would show off my custom of Baron Zemo. I think we were all ever so slightly disappointed that Zemo did not don the uniform in Captain America Civil War, but at least he didn't die in his first appearance, which is what seems to be the trend with most MCU villains. Either way, I can't wait for the Disney Plus show and the bigger development of this character. But now, on to my figure. I ended up going a maskless route because there aren't really any perfect purist options aside from maybe using Sinestro's or Calculator Said and then applying a purple bandana to cover up the mouth, but I didn't want to do that, so helmetless helmet it is. Starting from the top is the hair, which I pulled from Dr. McScrubs from the first Lego Movie line of sets. Moving down is the head, and Daniel Brühl's character has grown out his facial hair since we've last seen him, which is why I gave him Jim Hopper's head. The torso comes from Vulture, and it is pretty much perfect as, uh, as it includes the fur collar and various straps. I did, however, replace the black hands with a magenta pair, and to finish off Zemo, Darth Sidious' legs were implemented. So that's it for my custom Lego Baron Zemo based on his upcoming appearance in Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Are you guys excited for the show? Because I sure am. Also, comment any thoughts you have about this figure down below, and if you enjoy, don't hesitate to leave a like and subscribe for more Lego content. Thanks for watching, and until next time, goodbye.